and then it looks like you know what you're doing because you do know what you're doing. You're doing some basic stuff first. This nunchucks tutorial for beginners. You're going to get striking and spinning very fast with your nunchucks or nunchaku. Grab a pair of nunchucks and follow me. The nunchucks in your right hand, you're gonna have your hand right in the middle or closer to the tip here where the chain comes out or the string comes out. You're gonna start by cranking your hand forward just in this motion and that's gonna spin it in this outer orbital. Orbital just meaning going around the outside of my body. Now I'm gonna turn my hand palm facing the ground and do that same cranking motion. And that's gonna put the orbital on the inside of my body or the other side. You can also do that in the middle. Just make sure it's far away from your face. Go palm up. This is a warm up. You wanna keep your joints safe from injury during this workout. Palm down and then go up and down. Now you have an endless spin or an infinity spin. And the reason it's called that, watch the shape that this carves. That's a sideways figure eight or an infinity sign. So when someone says endless spin, they're really talking about infinity spin. It's the same thing, but you're doing your infinity spin. You do this in front of your body. This is part of nunchuck freestyle. This is also part of self-defense. You don't want to walk into my chucks when I'm swinging them like this, especially not these. These aluminum chucks, super hard, super heavy, super hard. These things hurt when they hit, more so than wood. That nice, long, tough, uh, un almost unbreakable chain. So you're swinging this in front of your body, right? Now, put it in the other hand, start that same forward motion, spinning. Remember, your hand's in the middle or closer to the end of the chuck. Palm facing up first, palm facing down. This is all to lubricate the joint, get that blood flowing, keep you safe from injury during this workout. Up, down, and then putting them together. And now you're spinning. Put that foot forward, that's my left foot. Left hand's doing the spin, keeping your back spinning this way. Bring that to a stop. Go back to the first hand and reverse everything. Instead of pushing forward, you're gonna pull in toward you. This is just a reverse orbital to the outside of my body. Reverse orbital inside of my body. Out a few times. And if you, I find that if you do it this way, you're gonna learn it faster. You're gonna pick these skills up very quickly. Outside, inside, and go outside to inside, pulling. Almost like you're just carving with that small side of your hand carving that sideways figure eight in that opposite direction. And same thing, you get behind it. Then, other hand, same thing. Warm up both hands. Eventually, I'm gonna show you, I have another pair of these nunchucks. These come from combative.com. If you're looking for a good pair of nunchucks. I just got these in, I think, uh, last week. Been messing with them. Been smacking myself with them. It's good, it's good feedback. You learn faster that way, so much faster. Hit yourself with a hard pair of nunchucks. You won't do the same thing twice. You won't make the same mistake over and over again. But it's good, you wanna learn. You want to hit yourself every once in a while. You wanna drop them over and over again. You wanna fight through the frustration. You wanna fight to learn, fight to grow. Get a couple of lumps along the way. Just don't quit, don't give up. All right, now back to the other hand and I want you to pull it to your shoulder I want you to learn right away how to go from one hand to the other hand without just putting it in your hand. That's pretty easy, right? But from here, you're gonna reach across your front of your body and grab it right under that arm. Let go here, and then you're gonna pull it out, smacking somebody right in the face. That hand goes in front of the body. Pull it out, and pull it out. Hand to hand, learn how to do this right from the first workout. You know how to do this, you know how to do most everything that someone like Bruce Lee does in the movies, or did in the movies. This is it. This motion, done really well, over and over again. Really fast, looks really good, right? Then you can add a spin to that. You know how to do the outer orbital, that's all it is. Add a spin to that. Spin, spin. Now you've just doubled your skill. Now you know how to go hand to hand 
while putting in an extra orbital spin in there. And all that's left from here, I'm gonna add that spin, is a couple of strikes. Come across the body and up, down and up. Always keep your hand up in front of your face when you fight. All right, so this first strike, and then I want you to bring it from here to the front of the body and back, just side to side, side to side. Now look what I'm doing with the tip of this combative nunchuck. I'm putting that on my body so that, I'll try to go on my toes here, when I bring it around, look, it's wrapping around my body. If I leave it out here, when I do that, it hits a little bit harder, right? That's kind of feedback, that's not the right kind of feedback because it's a mistake, right? Do that a couple times and then learn how to get that tight and let it wrap around your body and let your body absorb it correctly. Don't get a bunch of bruises because you're doing it wrong. So back and forth and then up to the arm, down and up. Bruce Lee right here, bicep, tricep, or tricep, I don't know, we'll tricep, tricep, both sides, front and back. We got this, front and back, one, and back, two, and back, three, a little quicker, four, five, switch hands. You already know how to do that. Add a little spin, bring it up, cross and back, bring it over, front and back, up here, so this upper arm just doesn't move. It's just the hand, the wrist, right? Going down and back. Do that a few times. And then over and back. Two, three, four, five. Grab it. One, grab it. Two, add that spin. That's all that is. When you start to freestyle, you're just adding moves together, other things you might know how to do, but play around with it. Start with the basics first, get really good at the basics. The basics are orbitals, figure eights, or endless spins, and then how do you go from one hand to the other hand, and this is the easiest one right here. This is the adding those things together, and then it looks like you know what you're doing because you do know what you're doing. You're doing some basic stuff first. Check out these other videos and what else you can do with a pair of nunchucks. Leave me comments on other things you want to learn, and I'll see you in the next video.